And we are also monitoring a developing story out of Coral Springs where a family has been attacked by their own dog. Local 10 News reporter Hatzel Vela is live with the details. Hatzel. Nicole, it turns out this was a pit bull that the family had been fostering for several weeks now. For some reason, the dog turned on the family, attacked one of the boys. Uh, his brother jumped in to help. The mother also jumped in, but all of them ended up injured and at the hospital. At around 2.45, our camera's there on the ground as an 11-year-old boy is rushed into a rescue chopper, then headed to Broward Health. Police say he and his 12-year-old brother, as well as their mother, were attacked by a pit bull they were fostering for a couple weeks. I'm the older brother, 12 years of age. Um, ended up separating the dog from the mom. He did end up stabbing the dog, um, which is now at a local animal hospital receiving treatment. Their next door neighbor still in awe over what she saw. All I can tell was when the little boy came knocking on my door, he just said everybody got hurt and uh, you got to come and help. The dog went crazy. Sky 10 over the scene, Coral Springs, Northwest 106th Avenue near Coral Springs Drive. Neighbors say they had seen the dogs before. They seemed harmless. Don't even bark at people, they say. Like I say, the only logical uh, explanation is that somebody was where they should have been, okay, or well, they provoke the dog. It, it, it doesn't, because like I say, they're docile dogs. A call came in at around 2.18 this afternoon. The mother, 35 years old, and her son, 12 years old, were also taken to the hospital. He had, he had some blood on the back of his neck, and when he turned his head, he did have like a little bit of a, a gouge on the back of his neck. Honestly, unless you saw the dog, you would know they had them. So the boy that was uh, airlifted to the hospital, we're told he'll likely have to undergo surgery because of the injuries to his face. But he and his brother and his mom are expected to be just OK. By the way, the dog was taken to Coral Springs Animal Hospital because of its injuries. After he is treated, he's likely going to be in quarantine for about two weeks. For now, reporting live in Coral Springs, I'm Hatsovella, Local 10 News.